Well, July is National Ice Cream Month, and in Lima, there is now one more ice cream opportunity to help celebrate this important holiday month. Today, Marky Chooks and Travis Monfort of the Marky Chooks Show introduces us to a brand new ice cream place. I checked it out last week. Lots of flavors, great food. You want to check it out yourself. It's Scoops Taste and See Ice Cream. What's up, y'all? This is your man of our town, Marky Chooks, with the Marky Chooks Show. Uh, we just out and about right now. Well, I ain't out and about. Travis is out and about. And he down at Scoops out on the south end on 4th Street, a newly opened ice cream stand. Heard they really got some get up, some things going on down there. Travis, what's going on, baby? That's right, Marky. We're over here at Scoops 126 East 4th Street. Write that down, Marky. 126 East 4th Street, uh, new ice cream shop. Uh, great owner, um, Miss Sylvia Clark. I know you guys are familiar with the name. Well, now she's stepping into the, the, the ice cream business. So we're coming over here to check her out. Go ahead and swing the camera around, Mr. Cameraman, so we can see what we're working with in here. Um, they've got over 20 different flavors of ice cream, over 20 different toppings uh just a lot of good things to choose from but um the lady of the hour we're going to talk to is miss sylvia clark miss clark please tell the people why is such a beautiful wonderful lady like you would start a <laughs> would start an ice cream shop up here in lima well thank you You're welcome. uh <laughs> it's really uh it, just something that really came about in a matter of of weeks mm -hmm. Uh, my husband and I uh, realized the building was here, and uh, we like we always have liked the idea of bringing business uh, on the south side, mm -hmm. and the idea that we could have a business that could hire some of the youth from this area mm -hmm. that have a difficult time getting jobs in other areas, and I'm very proud to say we have probably about eight youth, mm -hmm. high school and college kids working here, mm -hmm. and they're a fantastic group, mm -hmm. and everything just kind of went from there. Mm -hmm. uh, Steve, who left out somewhere, <laughs> uh, we after uh, Coleman and I figured out what we wanted to do, we got with our good friend Steve and Melina Robinson, mm -hmm. and we said, we're going to do this thing. And Steve and I went to a food event down at the Civic Center in February. We hit the road running after mm -hmm. that, hit the, hit the floor. Okay, talk about the uh, particular brand of ice cream you're using. Why is it that you decided to go with the uh, Hershey's brand ice cream? Steve and I went to a food show, and we tasted about four brands of ice cream. And Hershey's had the best flavor. Mm -hmm. It had the best taste. And when we started talking to friends and co-workers, we found that they too like the Hershey brand and it's not something you can buy in the store. Mm -hmm. So you got to come to us to get it. <laughs> okay, talk about just a few of the flavors you got here. I know we were talking about this, uh, this Superman one right here. I like, this looks interesting. So just tell them about this one. This, this is probably a very popular brand with the young ones. Mm -hmm. It's called Superman. It's very pretty. It's got all those pretty <laughs> colors in it. And uh, it's, it's, it's just a flavor that seems to be very popular with the young ones. Okay, so. and then you said you also have something for people that can't do the, 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 the lactose or the dairies or whatever. So uh, talk about the, the sherbets. What flavors you got with that? We have rainbow sherbet and orange sherbet. So if you have lactose issues or dairy issues, mm -hmm. those are our two non-dairy products. Okay, now, now talk about some of the other items that you'll be serving because you're not just ice cream. I mean, you know, actually, let's, let's swing this way. Let's look and see. Here go the toppings right here so you can get all this put on your ice cream. Um, so now tell us about uh, some of the um, other items that you'll be serving. Uh, oh, okay, Melina's going to, okay. Okay, tell us, tell us about some of the other items that you guys are going to have um, other than just ice cream. Banana splits, mm -hmm. um, shakes, mm -hmm. slushes. Um, and we also coming up with a Buckeye Sunday, which would okay. be scoop specialty. Okay. And okay, what about food items? Um, hot dogs, mm -hmm. Joe dogs, mm -hmm. slow dogs, um, sloppy joes, mm -hmm. barbecue beef, um, pork, mm -hmm. and shredded chicken, which is very popular. Okay. Full. So we're full service here. And chips. And we're working okay. on walking tacos. Walk tacos. And, um, how long do you uh, you plan on uh, keeping the, the shop open? Is uh, just seasonal, right? It is seasonal, and we will be open through the fall. Next year, we'll open in the spring and close in the fall. So it is seasonal. It is a typical ice cream place. And we have picnic tables on the other side. So come and enjoy your ice cream and sit at the picnic table if you want to just sit and chat. Okay. Now, what are your hours of operation? Um, and yeah, what are your hours of operation? Monday through Saturday, we're open 11 to 8. On Sundays, we're open 12 to 8. 
Don't forget, come down to Scoops, get some ice cream, uh, get some hot dogs, chips, slushies. It's all down here. On the south side, give me the address again. 126 East 4th Street, okay. Lima, Ohio. 126 East 4th Street, Scoops. Come down. Mark, come on, man. Right, on your you lunch know, break. We're okay, going to get a Facebook page, too. We're going to get a Facebook page. Um, um, hooked up, so give us about another couple of weeks. Okay, so be be on the lookout for that Scoops Facebook page as well, too. Hey, Marky, when you get done cutting hair, man, come on down here. Let's get some ice cream, man. So, hey, you guys all tell Marky peace. Peace, Marky. Peace, Marky. All right, then. All right, then. Uh, hi, how y'all doing, everybody? Uh, thanks. It's, it's cool. I, you know, I know Travis wasn't going to bring me, man, but you know what? I had somebody bring me something earlier today anyways, and I got me a little milkshake myself. You know what I'm saying? So, Try that strawberry milkshake, Marky say, when you go down there two scoops.